Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and very very happy to present this video to you and if you are new to this channel then make sure you click the subscribe button below this news is going to be very very good guys I think we have done this news very very good I, I think this news is about Ujwan small finance bank the results have come out guys but if you see the year on year comparison this company's growth is good but if you compare quarter on quarter the profit has been literally improved literally less guys but we are going to present I mean this this is the presentation now we are going to explain about this to you and if you like this video then make sure you share this video to your friends and without wasting time now let us go to this video guys as you can see this is the disclaimer portion they have given and in this we are going to see about the performance highlights which one building a mass market bank business over in this financial these four things we are going to cover under this Ujwan small finance bank latest update so this is the q3 fy20 means quarter third fy20 means financial 20 key highlights the profit of this company has been raised up 90 crore which means 98 percent year on year which means previous year at the same quarter the profit might might be at 45 crore and if you also see that the net interest income has been at 427 which means 52 percent year on year is comparison what is nii net interest income which means interest earned minus deposit interest given that is net interest income then gross advances has been developed up to 46 percent which means 13,617 crore and deposit based building they have the total deposit of 10,656 crore which is year, year upon I mean when we compare year on it is 100% boom in deposit and retail deposit is 138% year on year and CASA ratio what is what is first retail deposit retail deposit is nothing but the people who are coming I mean our individuals who are coming and depositing then what is CASA ratio CASA ratio means current account is to savings account has been 120% uh, growth year on year and as you see that focus on customer 51 lakh customers from 43 lakh customers year on year this company has started around 8 lakh customers guys this is very very good news and uh, they have acquired this licensing from this bank and in I mean as you know the IPO was issued the 37 rupees or trading as 52 rupees we also gave that this company may be see a target of 83 rupees also we posted a video guys and this video is going to see and performance highlight guys if you see now they are in 24 states they have totally 574 branches and 471 ATMs expanding custom base as we said yesterday and 17,700 employees are working this is not very important but disbursements as you can see from 2885 crore to 3403 crores guys wow I mean 18% jump and total deposit as I told yesterday I mean told about 5,376 crore 98% growth guys and retail deposit as you can see here that is also growth and the total income for this quarter in third financial list as you can see here q 3 fi 20 financial list total income I mean total income means I mean the net income earned is 5 I mean it is jumped from 511 to 781 crore if we compare year on year but if we compare quarter on quarter there is a slight decrease I tell I mean I told uh, above is guys that is due to provisioning issue they have done that net <coughs> Net is net interest income has jumped 52 percent from 280 crores to 427 crores and net interest margin guys net interest margin has been reduced from 10 11 percent to 10.9 percent I mean I mean just 0.1 percent only this means same double winning guys and if you see gross NPS at 0.9 percent this is 1.4 percent very good guys in gross NPA should reduce because NPA is non performing asset as I told already and the PAT that was CC say guys has correctly been given from 45 crores previous year Q3 FO in NP means previous year they have earned now 90 crores and return on assets from 1.7 percent of it is having 2.1 percent and return on capital I mean return on interest return on capital has, has been growth is stable guys from 10.4 percent that's now around 14 percent and as you can see here the Provision, provision as you can see here guys 148, 150, 135 it has been a stable level and what are the things we should see here they are given an update on as a micro banking business as you can see here the total gross revenue advances around this 3% 3 is belonging to Assam and they have 18 branches Assam with the advances of 424 crore 
and major impact in the upper Assam area which contributed around 1.2 percent of gross and uh, what is the axis you see here guys additional provision of 10 percent on standard assets for 4.9 crore that's only that and awards and recognitions they have given for this bank and this bank is the best bank to work they have given and Ujman Small Business Bank is I think they are gonna rock tomorrow one thing is possible if you see this video fully don't miss it guys the only a big thing is coming a building mass bank market so if this like this video then don't forget to subscribe my channel for more videos like this guys and we are gonna see this is very very important news now and as you can see here what are the type of loans they are going to give they have micro banking micro small and enterprise loan affordable housing loan are given vehicle loan personal loan financial institutions they have given guys and channels what are channel i mean de first you can see deposits what are deposits deposits but current account savings account term deposit gold based savings digital savings institutional products for big companies third parties means they are serving for insurance other internal services so channel branch marketing atm mobile based <coughs> phone based etc guys and target segment who are they looking to combine and uh, get it they are trade they are looking at traders retailers and msc means medium small enterprises salary to corporate salary youth <coughs> <coughs> major youth they are covering and senior citizens they are covering guys and as you see that marginal farmers allied agriculture segment these are they are covering and as i said earlier ramp retail deposits 4624 crores versus 1940 crores year on year <coughs> which means that when comparing year on year previous year the retail deposit was just 1945 crore but now it is around 4624 crore guys and this is the classification <coughs> classification of other income as you know the fees based income they are collecting around 189 crores for simple say you can see 139 crores they are getting from processing fees uh, NHCS means the transaction payment and uh, dividend payment they are want to transfer in the net by the bulk basis so they are getting for bad debt recovery and others and uh, let's see these other things as i said they are working for personal business interbanking atms phones this all and leading what can they what can help them to grow efficiently growth digital transactions from 8 percent to 25 percent year on year they are doing guys and uh, better turn around time it has <coughs> moving towards cash rate disbursement from 93 percent to 98 percent it has been improved well they diversified pan india funds as i as they mentioned earlier and you should note that the gross advances major portion is coming from tamil nadu t in tamil nadu this is uh, in the first place and ga and up uttar pradesh i mean they are giving the region wise discretion and you should note that 34 percent is south is acquiring and second place goes to east and north is coming third place case and these are the three growth strategies what they are trying to say means we want to give comprehensive and relevant products focus on digital banking and build a stable deposit base and help our customers case they are they are saying this and business over you and this is very very important don't miss it right now it's very very important guys and the deposit and the disbursement has been increased and portfolio breakup as you can see here secure is coming uh 21% unsecured is 79% as you can see here from year year on year from 84% unsecured this is all is for unsecured guys and this unsecured from 84% has been reduced to 79% here and as you can see in the totally what they are trying to say means they are trying to reduce their unsecured portion and trying to cover all things under secured portion so that it could help haul and the bank also guys and you can see here total growth uh, loan growth year on year is 5.5 percent but quarter on quarter group loans has been reduced but micro banking has seen a boom guys from quarter on quarter growth is just 0.3 but if you compare year on year growth it is 14.6 percent it is very very good no <coughs> and if you can see the stable liability portfolio guys i mean the refinance is 2000 crore and the others I mean the deposit base and the deposit breakup 
is being uh, maintained very very good guys and you can see here the deposit breakup also they are given cost of deposit ratio is 120 percent versus 12 percent guys oh my god where is 12 percent and where is 120 percent within year on it i mean they are giving and it's also known the cost of funds is also being reduced and cost of ratio and cost being reduced frequently and widely guys and well they diversify deposit mix they have given and uh, this is the capital adequacy capital they are trying to maintain and they given that with the small finance banking license requirement the bank got listed raised around 1045 crores so they are trying to make i mean for normal banks the capital adequacy ratio is very very important and here c or here they should maintain guys and they are holding a healthy liability position so financial overview what they are trying to say means they are trying to say the net interest margin has been constant in the range of 11% to 10.7 i mean 11% to 10.7 it is just they are maintaining the 11 ratio and you should see here guys the cost to income ratio from 77% it has come down to 71% you may think it is this 6% but that's not a matter guys that is very very good thing to note and pre provisioning profit it was 70 crores previously it is now 144 crores double time it has improved and book value of share when i was recording my video i just said this company is having book value of 11.6 rupees now it is 17 rupees book value guys i mean if this book value keep on increases then we can have a hope on this bank also and this this is the income statement i want to show to you all guys we see here the interest earned if you compare year on year it is very very good 707 crore and total income is coming 780 crore but if we see the finance cost has been improved why guys it has improved due to the interest income they have earned it is the cost has increased and uh, the credit cost from 7 crore it is moved to 31 crore case and profit before tax 66 crore 144 114 crore and the total profit is coming to 45 crore so is 90 crore guys other income breakup on already we are given the breakup above and this is the total other income they are given giving Processing fees come contributing 44 crore and balance recovery contributing and the total which is contributing other income is processing fees is contributing almost 90% of their uh, other income sources case and this is a balance sheet they are trying to give capital has been improved and deposit also has been improved borrowing has been reduced that is you see guys what is borrowing banks taking borrowing from others it is different from deposit which other third party loan they have taken it has been reduced year on year constantly if we see year on year from 3593 now it is just 3099 and the cash balance of reserve bank of india is increasing that should be a point to note guys and the advances you have given that is good and fixed assets they have improved and this is a shareholding pattern as and december that it was 19 the promoter is holding 88 percent very very good guys and the foreign investors are holding this green color they are holding 4.9% and uh, mutual funds are holding 1.7% this is experienced managed team they are trying to say and uh, I wish I think I could contribute my maximum in this video guys I have contributed my maximum in this video if you like this video then make sure you please subscribe my channel for more videos like this and leave my suggestions below regarding any issues so that we could uh, track it positively and help you guys and see another video very soon